Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're doing another best possible. Um, fit was down, but it's back up now. Um, you don't understand how much I fucking hate EA right now. They're trying to get to rid, rid of club, club names. It's like, can you not understand that price ranges didn't fix it? They found ways around it. Obviously, that the fucking getting rid of club names isn't going to solve it because they'll still find ways to, to buy coins around that they won't stop because they keep they need the money so um i'll probably do another video on this but here we have our best possible barcelona squad um this i'm pretty sure i double checked i'm pretty sure every single card is the highest card i could find like uh, on the subs as well so i'm pretty sure this is like exactly right so yeah, so let's go into the goal. We got uh, Valdez. Um, I'm pretty sure he left the game in FIFA 14. Uh, yeah, Victor Valdez uh, left the game in FIFA 14, which is pretty sad. He retired. Anyway, yeah, he's, he's highest rated card speed 13 team of the season. Uh, 89 rated. That's pretty cool. And then we go on to the centre backs. We got Poyle. Um, he, I can see him, he also left in FIFA 14 as well. I can see him getting a, a legend card because he, he, he is pretty OP, OP is, I never actually used him, but um, I'm pretty sure in FIFA 10 he had an 86 card and two informs because they never had different colours in FIFA 10 for informs. Um, and so I'm just going to go, I guess this is an inform. Um, but 99 rated in FIFA 10 and 94 defending and 93 heading. Wow. Um, and then the two other um, centre backs are obvious, really. Um, we've got PK, who had a 93 as his highest rated card. I'm pretty sure that was a team of the year or team of the season. That might be a team of the season, I don't know. Or a really good info, I don't know. Um, and then we've got Mascherano from the same year. Who had an 87 card? Pretty sure, yeah, it must, it must, yeah, it's probably team of the season, isn't it? I don't know. I'm really sure of this. And then we go on to uh, the left back and the right back. Um, they got uh, probably uh, the best right backs and left back. Barcelona have got the best right back and left backs in the game, probably. That's my opinion. They got quite good um, defenders. Um, I, I, I always use Alves in my. Um, in my La Liga teams and stuff, so and Jordi Alba's highest rated card was 87 in FIFA 13 team of the season, and then we got Alves, his highest rated card was in FIFA 14, 91 rated team of the year. He was probably the most hated guy, as long along with um, David Luiz, who shouldn't have deserved the team of the year. Um, a lot of people were hating him as well, as well as this year with uh, David Luiz. Pretty sure it's Danny Alves because, yeah, I'm pretty sure, but um, I'm not actually sure. Uh, and then we go on to Xavi. He is actually, I looked this up, he's actually been playing since, like, he's been at, like, Barcelona for so many years. He's, like, started at, like, 1997, I think he, he signed at Barcelona. A long time. It's so unreal. That's probably why he's one of the best players and he's still going as one of the best players in the world, which is actually unreal, really. Um, 97 card he had in FIFA 12. Um, team of the year? I don't know. I fucking don't know. These, they should really of like, EA again made a massive mistake not putting in freaking colours on their fucking cards. Um, and then we got Busquets, another Barcelona legend. Um, He's always been at Barcelona, pretty much. And he had a 1989 racing card. That's his highest rated card ever. Um, Sergio Busquets, 89 team of the season. And then we got Iniesta, obviously. He's probably been in every single team of the year, like, ever. Because he has had so many cards. He is, like, another Barcelona legend. He's always been at Barcelona. It's and they're all Spanish as well. The, like... Iniesta, Xavi and Busquets are all Spanish and they've always been at Barcelona. Actually unreal. Um, Iniesta's like, as well as Messi, but these are like older, but you know what I mean. Um, he had 96, Carvey 13 as well, team of the year. Um, he's been like every single team of the year. 
And then we got um, Suarez, who's only Suarez, <laughs> who's only been at uh, Barcelona for a year. So um, he is doing good for himself. I must admit, 99 rated in form from this year, recent actually. Um, and then we got Messi. Um, who has the joint highest rated card on foot ever along with Ronaldo that came this year He had a 99 rated special card in FIFA 12. Everyone wanted this card. It's like 99 everything. It's like um, Ronaldo this year. So yeah, that's the famous starting 11. Every single card is above 87 rated, which is unreal um, And then we go to the bench, which is even cooler actually a lot of legends on this bench really uh, we've got Neymar, he's just in there uh, uh, because there's no like left wing and yeah. And then we've got Pedro, who's also left wing. I don't know why he's not red, uh, right wing. So his, uh, his uh, card below this, he's had an 86 rated card that was on the right wing. Uh, but it's obviously the highest rated, isn't it? So um, 87 rated. And then Abidal, he is another legend that I think is going to go on be on the game in a few years. Abidal is probably a really good he FIFA, FIFA 11 86 rated card he is a legend um now at I don't know what team now um and then we've got Rakitic who only recently transferred last year in FIFA 14 um 85 rated his highest rated card so far and then Afale um who plays for PSV who or he did play for PSV or something um 90 pace you had um um yeah I didn't even realise that he had a card there, so I changed it. And then we got Kieta. Um, I don't know if he's still on the game, but um, he was on the game. And then we got Marquez. Marquez. Um, he is a, a Mexican. He is. He has recently, not recently, but a couple weeks, months ago, he had a pink card on um, FIFA iOS. And yeah, so. Um, <laughs> Uh, this was the only year in FIFA 10. He was the only year playing for Barcelona. I think this is a non-rare card as well. So, um, yeah. So, yeah, that is the best Barcelona squad. This was uh, requested on our last best possible I did. Um, I've still got loads more to do. And if you keep giving me suggestions, it just build up my list. And, yeah. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want me to do a round video about the whole EA coin selling is gone, RIP, shit. So yeah, uh, leave a comment if you want to see that. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, guys.